Hit Craddock in the morning. The Showbiz Top 5. Hey, this is Kelly Raspberry with your Showbiz Top 5 for Wednesday. It's July 29th. It's been a long and ugly battle, but Hulk and Linda Hogan have finally reached an agreement in their divorce settlement, but details aren't being released to us. Um, we did see them smiling, chatting with each other before the proceedings yesterday. Linda even leaned over to give Hulk a kiss at one point, and after it was over, she said the war is over. They both just hope to move on and try to be friends and at least be good parents to their two children. Now, the two of them are married back in 83 and she filed for divorce in November of 07 and completely blindsided Hulk. A reporter asked him about the divorce filing and that was completely news to him. Now, Misha Barton flew to New York from LA yesterday to begin work on her new CW show produced by Ashton Kutcher called The Beautiful Life. Now, filming had to be delayed for about a week or so because Misha was involuntarily checked into the psychiatric ward at Cedar sinai after running into a little bit of a issue, medical issue they called it. And now that she's out, she's trying to get back on a healthy path and Nicole Richie is actually mentoring her through it because while Misha has had her history with drugs and alcohol, so has Nicole Richie who has completely done a, a 180 so she wants to, I guess, pay it forward with her friend Misha. Kate Goslin has bought a new condo in Rockville, Maryland and it just so happens to be a block away from her bodyguard's house. This bodyguard's also rumored to be her boyfriend, you remember. Now, John's already bought his own condo in New York City, and what the plan is, is for the kids to stay planted in Pennsylvania at the family home there, and John and Kate will just take turns with the visitation doing alternate weeks, which is really the only way you can do it when you have eight kids to consider shuffling around. Twilight fans a bit shocked to find out that Victoria, the part of Victoria, has been recast. Rochelle Lefebvre, has played her in The New Moon, the second one in the series, but for Eclipse, Bryce Dallas Howard has been brought in to take over the part, both fiery redheads. But um, Rochelle is saying it has nothing to do with her inability to carry the part. She said it was a scheduling conflict because on August 17th, she's going to start filming this new independent movie in Rome with Robert, or excuse me, Dustin Hoffman, and that is the exact same day that Eclipse starts filming in Vancouver. And then finally, apparently, uh, this court order to stay 50 yards away from Rihanna doesn't really mean so much to either Chris Brown or Rihanna. The two of them last week were both seen staying at Trump International the same weekend, separate rooms, but still there at the same time. And then last night in New York, both of them are having dinner from each other directly across the street at separate restaurants, which is really kind of hard to pull off in a big city like that. But what sources say, and I guess it is the law, that um, even though he's required to stay 50 yards away from her unless they're at like a, a professional gig, unless Rihanna files a report, a complaint with the police, they can't pick him up. So they can continue this little cat and mouse game, I guess, until the judge finally releases him from the terms of the restraining order. And that is your Showbiz Top 5 for Wednesday.